In this Cinelera tutorial I will show you how to crossfade videos or use transition effects. I've assumed you have a basic understanding of editing in Cinelera. A link to my beginners tutorial is included in the description below for those that don't. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. Okay, well I've set up Cinelera to play four videos and um, I'm also using proxy clips to make it a bit easier. Okay, so basically here's the videos. Bosch, okay. So, video transitions. Left click on the tab that says video transitions and you've got some options here. Hold your left mouse button down and drag one of the transitions so it's over two of the clips. Now if you right click on the little icon you've got a few um, options here. You can remove it by left clicking on detach. If you left click on show you've got a couple of options and this one I wouldn't bother with any of those options. Or if you want to increase the length, just left click on the length box. And I'm going to literally take this up to two seconds. So it's a bit longer. OK. And that's one of the options, band slide. Just do another one. If you want to just do a crossfade, use the dissolve. Again, place it over the two tracks. Right click on it. And if you should find that you're, if you've set it up, one of them up for two seconds or four or whatever, the other one should be set up. If it isn't, just right click on the time and set your time up again. I don't think on dissolve there's much you can do. No. So, that's just basically a straightforward dissolve between two video clips. And the other, the, another interesting one, you can play around with these, but another interesting one is the shape wipe. If you bring this into over one of your uh, clips, I think this is probably two seconds, yeah, you've got some options. So at present, if I play this, just get a bit nearer it. At present, it'll play a sort of circle. If you left click on the little arrow, don't release your mouse button, your left mouse button, you've got a few options. So let's go back to the beginning. So I've set this up as clock, and you've got the option using like a clock shape okay so that's basically it unlike some video clips you just put all your clips together you don't bother putting one underneath the, each other which makes for an easier setting of the time on your transitions okay and the only other thing obviously you'll probably want to have crossfade on your audio so just go into the audio transitions and there's drag crossfade which should match up to your other transitions if we right click on it it's two seconds and just put a crossfade over each of the audio tracks And that's basically all there is to it. What you should find now is you've got some examples of transitions, crossfade, and another transition. I shan't go into rendering or anything like that because, of course, at the beginning, I assume you have a basic understanding of um, editing in Cinelera. One thing I would say, the version I'm using is something called GG Infinity. It's the only one worth bothering with now and it's, it's really quite good. So 
if you want to install this on your uh, Linux computer I've got a link in the description below on the easiest way at present to install it um, and the other thing is if you're using proxy clips don't forget to turn them off by left clicking on the little P and wait for it to set back up again and once it's finished it should be good to render hopefully that's helped somebody thank you for watching cheers